An electric motor is a machine that converts energy from electrical to mechanical. It has two types of components, stationary and rotational. If you are new to this channel, just hit the subscribe button for free. Electric motors work on the principle of electromagnetism that combines electricity and magnetism. An example of electromagnetism is wrapping an electric wire around a metallic cylinder to lead the magnetic flow in a specific direction. A magnet has two sides, north and south. Same sides repel. Different sides attract. When you fixate a magnet on a pivot and attempt to attract it to another magnet with the same side, it would be forced to spin 180 degrees to the opposite side. The polarities of the external magnets have to be interchanged in order to spin the internal magnet with another 180 degrees that returns it to its original position. By repeating these two steps alternately, the internal magnet would spin continuously in a specific direction. A commutator reverses the electric current flow for every 180 degrees of spin without changing the polarity of the external magnets. One side is for sending and the other one is for receiving. More internal magnets in the rotor should be added to maintain a constant rotational speed around the stator. Together, these internal magnets are housed in an armature that continuously rotates with its periodically changing polarity like an alternating current. By connecting two batteries of the same kind, you double the motor power. Depending on how you connect them, one of the power elements is increased, current or voltage. To double the motor torque, connect the two batteries in parallel. To double the motor speed, connect the two batteries in series. Electric motors are used in the wheels of line following robots, sliding doors on entrances, pulleys that move elevator counterweights, propeller blades for quadcopter drones or cooling fans, and mechanical gears for cassette players and power steering cars. I hope you enjoyed watching this interesting video.